So here are some of the most watched videos from the winksound.com community. That's right, these come from members just like you who've uploaded your videos into the site, and these are some that we think you really gotta see. Beatmatch.info explains how to sample audio in Ableton Live. After our track is loaded, let's warp the track to get it synced with the markers. After warping, I'm listening the track to find a portion of a record I want to sample. When you find the sound you want to cut, move the start marker to the beginning of the sound. Now press record and play the clip. Black RVP shows us how to create mix subgroups within record. One unique thing about Reason or more or less Record is that it's broken down into three windows. This window, which is the mix window up under F5, F6, which is your rack window, which lets you see all of your plugins and audio channels and mix channels, and F7, which is your singer window. Um, if you do any combination of the two, which would be um, F6. This right here is one of my audio channels, the last one, Brass 7. Audio channels have direct outputs, which can be broken to kill the signal. I'll be able to see all of my mix here in that sub mixer, but I would have control over here on the sub channel. Padro Padro 22 gives us examples of what plugins he finds work best within Logic Studio. I like to start out with drums. So here's here's Battery 3. For those of you who don't have Logic and are thinking about getting it, I, re I highly recommend it. Um, if you have a Mac, obviously. The Pro 53 Synth plugin from Native Instruments. It sounds amazing. Hey, thanks so much for watching. We really hope you enjoyed this webcast. And of course, if you have any more music production questions or tips that you'd like to see answered, send out questions our way, rick or mateo at wingsound.com. Remember, you could always keep in touch with the latest stuff happening on wingsound.com by following us on Twitter. That's at wingsound. That's right. Another great way to stay on top of wingsound stuff is through iTunes. Check out keyword wingsound and you'll be able to subscribe for the free podcast and be able to stay up to date on the latest releases coming out of Wingsound Studios. And of course, for more music production videos and tutorials like this, check out wingsound.com, the new social video network for audio creatives.